Today we are going to be learning about South African cultural uniqueness. So, our country is a multicultural country. It therefore has a large variety of cultural groups. Those groups are mainly Zulu, Kosa, Pedi, Tswana, Ndebele, Khoisan, and Afrikaner people. Those groups have different ways of doing things. It's also comprised of different languages that consist of 11 official languages and is therefore called the Rainbow Nation. Within this context, I would like to look at the following. Folklore, dress, and cuisine. Folklore refers to the legends, myths, fair tales that are told within a particular cultural group. They can, they can also be passed from generation to generation. Dress refers to, to the way in which each culture that group wears, which might be their traditional attire, and this can also be identified as the cultural group and can also help one identify the cultural group. Cuisine. Cuisine refers to the traditional meals that a particular group mostly eats or can be identified by. Okay, I would like to ask a few questions based on the above. Which cultural group has men who wear peshi peshu as their traditional attire? Yes, ma'am. Zulus. Zulus. Okay. What is another <coughs> word for mobile names? Yes, ma'am. Which cultural group mostly occupies the Eastern Cape? Yes, ma'am. Yes, it's correct. This group calls the broom or sweeper um um tanyelo, or they refer to water as a emad. Yes, sir. Sorry, people. Sorry, people. All right, thank you.